your name? Who are you right now? Speak out. Catalina. What have you done in her life? How have you destroyed her life? I don't want her to be happy. You don't want her to be happy. How did you enter her life? Holy Ghost, fire in Jesus' mind. Speak out in Jesus' name. How did you enter her life? Speak out in Jesus' mighty name. How did you destroy her life? Through what means did you destroy her life? Every time happiness comes, it goes. Every time happiness comes, it goes. So you, you took her happiness away. Never do one day to be happy. How long have you been in her life? Speak out right now. How long have you been in her life? You made the greatest mistake to uh, allow her to come to Reign of Liberty. Right now, you will go right now in Jesus' mighty name. Holy Ghost, fire 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 in Jesus' mighty name. Because of Christ, who declare you free, healed, and delivered in Jesus' mighty name. In Jesus' mighty name. Can you tell us what happened, madam? How, uh, what, what just happened just few days? Are you, are you the one that's pain? Did you cause yourself pain? Did you, are you the one to take your happiness away? No. So that evil spirit that was tormenting your life right now has been cast out. And you are free in Jesus' mighty name. So raise your hands and say thank you, Jesus. We welcome you here to the uh, prayer line in the United States with anointing water. Can you tell us your name and where you're from? Yes, my name is Crystal Pope. I'm originally from North Carolina, but I live in Renton, Washington right now. Uh, can you tell us what are the problems that brought you here today to the prayer line with anointing water? Yes, I'm going through a divorce with my husband, and it's just been a whirlwind from the, for the past two years uh, since I moved to relocated from North Carolina to here, just not having any happiness. My marriage um, was ended. We have a daughter together, and, and it's still like... I'm going through a lot of hard stuff. Uh, uh, can you tell us what happened as you came to the prayer with anointing water and the evangelist was praying for you? What, what happened at that point? I was praying in tongues when I came up because I always like to pray in tongues for God's covering. And um, all of a sudden, I just felt like I was being choked. And in and, and the choking, it, I just thought maybe it's just me. You know, something was caught in my throat. And then I felt like it, it just kept on and then I, f I felt like an out-of-body experience like I don't know exactly I just know the guy that's sitting beside me <laughs> in church said something about me acting some way so so was it you that was saying now that I took her happiness I took her joy was that you or was it the demon speaking out of you I wouldn't take my happiness I wouldn't take my joy it had to be a demon it had to be a demon if that's what I said <laughs> and uh can you and can you confirm that, that that's what's been happening in your life, that the, the happiness has been going away and there's no joy, there's no peace? Yes, I can definitely confirm that there's been no joy, no peace, and no happiness. Even when I think things is at peace, it something comes up and it just destroys all happiness. I get anxious, I get fearful, I get stressful, and it just comes into my mind and it's so heavy, like it's uncontrollable. And I'm like, why am I not happy? Why can't I ever be happy? And there's even people in my life that has told me, you don't ever seem to be happy since I've been here. So can you tell us that, the, that now that we see that the demon is the cause of this problem, um, how did you feel after the prayer with the, with the anointing water? How did you feel after you stood up? How do you feel after that? When I stood up, I felt a little weak and shaken and like, disoriented like what you know what's you know what's going on I was really really warm um, I felt the sharp pain in my arm just a little um, but for the most part I um, I feel lighter I feel like a weight has been lifted I feel like my face is clear and I actually just feel light just even talking I feel chills which I haven't felt in a while of God on me so you believe that God Almighty has set you free and has delivered you from every darkness in your life 
Yes, I, I know God has set me free and, and delivered me from every darkness. Whatever it is that was attached to me, it ain't on me no more. Thank you, Jesus. We thank God for your life. Now that God Almighty has set you free from everything that was causing you pain and causing you not having happiness, we encourage you to stay close to Jesus. Ground yourself in his word that this deliverance, this miracle that God has done in your life will be permanent for the rest of your life. In Jesus' name. In Jesus' name. Amen. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus.